Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you some tips that will help you to increase the speed the internet on your computer running Windows 11. Mostly, some users think that the problem of slow internet from the internet service provider. Watch these tips before upgrading your internet plan. The problem could be system settings, apps, or background processes that are causing your connection to crawl at a slow rate. Upgrading your internet plan is a valid solution but should be a last resort. There are a large number of other tips, tricks and fixes that can significantly increase your internet speed. Anyway, if you can identify the problem that is causing a bad internet connection, head to the fix right away. The first of these tips is, specify the bandwidth for updates from Windows 11 settings. Windows 11 allows you to manually set less bandwidth for uploads and downloads. If you experience slow internet, you can also disable updates being sent to other devices to increase internet speed. And I will explain to you how to limit the bandwidth. Just open the start menu from the taskbar. Then open the settings. Then select the Windows Update tab from the bottom left of the settings page. From the Windows Updates page, click on Advanced Options. Under Additional Options, locate and click on Delivery Optimization. If you don't want to share Windows updates with other PCs, disable the toggle for Allow Downloads from other PCs by clicking the toggle to off. This option is very important to avoid slow internet. Scroll down and select Advanced Options to limit the bandwidth for download and upload. Under Download Settings, you have two options. The first option is Absolute Bandwidth, and this option will allow you to enter the absolute value to be used for downloading updates in the background and foreground. Enter the appropriate bandwidth limit in both text fields with numbers. The next option under Download Settings is to set bandwidth consumption by the percentage of the update source. Select Percentage of Measured Bandwidth, tick the checkboxes for both options, and drag the slider to set the desired value for both. Next, Upload Settings. There are two sliders to limit the bandwidth for downloading updates on other computers, and a monthly update limit. Select the checkboxes for both and drag the slider to set the desired value. It depends on the internet you have. After completion, this advice will increase the speed of the internet for normal use. Try it now, and follow the rest of the tips. Tip 2. Change the DNS server. Windows 11 automatically adjusts the network settings, and therefore the DNS server is set by default, which may cause slow internet connection. Therefore, it is recommended to switch to an open source DNS server, and it is better to adjust these settings manually and to manually set DNS server, press Windows plus R to launch the run command. Type ncpa.cpl in the text field, then click OK at the bottom, or press Enter to launch the network connections window. If you are connected to a wireless network, right-click the Wi-Fi network adapter. If it's a wired connection, choose Ethernet. Then, select Properties from the context menu. Next, find and select Internet Protocol version 4, TCP IPv4. Then, click on Properties. Select Use the following DNS server addresses, in the Internet Protocol version 4, TCP IPv4, Properties dialog, and enter the Google Public DNS server, enter 8.8.8.8 in preferred DNS server, then enter 8.8.4.4 on the alternative DNS server. Then, click OK at the bottom to save the changes. After completion, restart your computer, and check if the internet speed is increasing, or the same. Tip 3. Close background programs. Of course, programs running in the background consume a certain percentage of bandwidth, which slows down the speed of the internet. 
Since these applications are not in active use, it can be difficult to determine the reason for the slow internet. Apart from slowing down the internet, these apps also slow down the system, which makes it very necessary to terminate them. To end applications running in the background, right-click on the start icon on the Windows taskbar. Then, select Task Manager from the list of options. Then, navigate to the Performance tab. Then at the bottom of the Task Manager, and click on Open Resource Monitor. This will open the Resource Monitor window. Navigate to the Network tab, and look out for programs with higher values under the Send and Receive columns. These programs affect the internet speed by taking up most of the bandwidth. Right-click the task you want to terminate, and select End Process from the context menu. My advice is not to finish all the processes in the list. Some of them are important to the functioning of Windows, and they may work on some processes, such as Chrome. It is necessary to make an informed decision when terminating operations. Ending processes, and programs running in the background, will have a good effect on the speed of the internet, and on the performance of your computer in terms of performance speed. Tip 4. Disable apps from running in background. Many applications are always running in background, and these applications not only consume bandwidth but also system resources. It is perfectly wise to disable these apps, in case they cause a problem. In order to be able to disable apps from running in the background, go to Windows Settings 11. Then click on Apps in the left bar. Then select Apps and Features on the right. You will find a list of all the applications on the computer. Find the application that you do not want to run in the background. Click the ellipsis next to it, and select Advanced Options, from the menu. Under Background Apps Permissions, click on the drop-down menu under Let this app run in the background. Then select Never, from the drop-down menu, to disable the app from running, in the background. Windows 11 does not allow you to disable all applications at once and forever, like Windows 10, so you will need to disable each application individually, and you can analyze applications that are important for your work, and keep them enabled. Disabling applications from running in the background, will help you in faster internet performance, and also the speed of your computer. Try it now! Tip 5 Turn off metered connections. Having a metered connections configuration on your Windows 11 PC can be another reason for slow internet. Right click on the Wi-Fi network or Ethernet then, select the network and internet settings. Then click on Wi-Fi. Now, select your network connection. The name of the network that is currently connected. Then, disable the toggle for metered connection. Check if there's an increase in internet speed after disabling the metered connection. I think this step is very important to increase your internet speed. Tip 6 Scan your PC for viruses and malware. Your PC infected with malware or virus is likely to experience problems with internet speed. All you need to do is, scan your PC for viruses and malware, using a reliable antivirus. I recommend using Windows Security. A built-in antivirus in Windows, that offers the same level of security as any other third-party antivirus. To perform the scan, open Windows Security. Type Windows Security in the search box. Then open it from the search results. Then. Select the Virus and Threat Protection app in Windows Security. You will find the button to run a quick scan. But, I intend to run a full system scan. So, to view and choose from other types of scans, click on Scan Options. Next. Select the Full Scan option, and click on Scan Now, at the bottom to initiate the scan. The computer will start scanning immediately. 
you can continue working on the system while the scan running. Once it is completed, you will receive notification of any malware or viruses detected, with the appropriate action to combat them. Always have to scan the computer periodically, regardless of the slow internet. If none of these tips work, you have no other option but to upgrade your internet plan. Your ISP should offer other plans with higher speeds. These are the best solutions to increase internet speed on Windows 11. However, there are other tricks that can work for different users. I hope the video is useful to you, thank you for watching, and I hope subscribe to my channel, thank you all.